from my local beauty supply store. Mommy, and it's a 16 fluent ounce. Mommy. Yes. Okay guys, so what's up? This is your girl Shalinda One and welcome back for another hair video. But this is not for my hair. This is for little Miss Kennedy. Say hi mama. Hi. And we are, come here, where are you going? You gotta get back over here. Stay there. And we about to, what are we about to do to your hair? Can, can you turn it down for me real quick? What, um, can you tell them what, what we about to do to your hair? Yeah. What we about to do to your hair? Yes. Like what? What are we doing? Uh, yeah. We're washing. You're going to wash your hair. Wash. Yeah, we're going to wash your hair today. Wash And somebody up. asked me to show how I wash her hair. So, come on, baby. Stand right there. You got to stay in the picture. Stay right there. So, what we're doing in her hair right now is, um, I guess I'm deep conditioning it. You know how we do in this house. We're throwing every winter hat we had. We have, but I didn't do it to her. She only has on three hats. We have on her hair right now is castor oil, jojoba oil, glycerin, and a tiny, eensy weensy one squeeze of the three minute miracle. I see three minute, three minute miracle. That's all that's in her hair, and it's been in her hair for about ten minutes. So when we come back, I'll be starting her wash process. Say bye bye. Hi, Create Pretty Girl. Hi. <laughs> so this is, I'm about to wash her hair. And as you can see, I know you really can't see, but that's just a bunch of oils in her hair right there. Okay, so today we will be washing her hair. Well, usually, say if I'm not doing a, a deep cleanse, or I'm really, really trying to um, wash her hair real good, I'll use the Icy Cleansing Men. It's a conditioner that does both really like this, especially on her hair because her hair doesn't really like shampoo at all. But today, I'm going to use the organic, the Shea Moisture's Organic Coconut and Hibiscus. Stop, baby. Curl and Shine Shampoo. So this is what I'm going to be using today. Hey, pretty. Hi. Hi. How you doing? Nothing. You're doing nothing. Okay, so I'm going to zoom in so you can see it a little bit more. Okay. <laughs> You're so silly. Yep. Oh, and there's coconut oil in here too. So it was castor oil, glycerin, coconut oil, jojoba oil, and a tiny bit of the IC3 Minute. Why do I do this? Because I'm using the shampoo, and like I said, her hair really doesn't like shampoo, so I just want to keep as much moisture in it as possible. Now, right here, right now, her hair is still on the. It's not so bad to where I have to put it in and wash it in um, in ponytails yet. So I'm taking it onto my this part of my hands, and I'm going straight into her scalp. And I'm just massaging her scalp. But this is a really good method if you have a little toddler and you find that the shower doesn't work as well. I mean, it's not that it didn't work well. It's just that I was always having to pull her hair back. And, you know, I took the fun away from bath time. So by just doing this, she enjoys it. She feels like a big girl. Come on, and I can really get into her scalp without breaking my back. You ever try to wash your daughter's hair in the shower? Your back be killing me. I guess that's how I know I'm getting old. You can wash your baby's hair more than one time. Typically, I don't. Typically, Stop, Typically, I only rinse through her hair one time, but today I actually might do it twice. Shady. 
if you don't know, she's still too young for a lot of different ingredients. Her hair is still maturing. Her hair is not mature yet. And therefore, I refuse to put a bunch of, um, I refuse to put a bunch of, and I don't, just in case y'all didn't see what I just did, I put this in there just so I can catch exactly how much uh, shedding she has, which she doesn't have a lot. Or if, if any, she might have like two or three pieces, but that's about it. Now, if you notice, I'm not washing her hair. I'm washing her scalp. And by me washing her scalp, her hair is getting clean as I rinse the shampoo out. Mommy, I'm going to wash Huh? Harry, wash. Mm-hmm, wash. Harry, Yeah, baby. Harry, Harry. So, if you have a little one, be very careful about what you put in their hair. What you put in your hair, their hair may not be ready for because their hair is not mature enough. I would wait until my baby gets at least five before I put certain things in. At these young ages, I would definitely recommend stick with natural products, which is why I, I use the Shea Moisture's in her hair. The only product, other product that you, if you looked at her other videos that I do use in her hair is the Be Mine. But just like I said in my last video, I haven't ordered anything from Be Mine. So I haven't ordered anything for her from Be Mine. Something on my nail is snagging. I don't like it. What's wrong, mama? Okay, put that down. There you go. Be Mine has amazing, nice, gentle stuff for natural hair. Okay. I have this, the water on medium. It's not hot, it's not cold, it's right in the middle. Lukewarm. children actually have beautiful textures of hair. They get it from their mama. They just got it from, you know, deep, 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 deep inside me. Because I darn sure don't have it. Kenzie, please don't do that. Stop, baby. Let that go. So I'm just rinsing out the shampoo really good. I want to make sure every single trace of that shampoo is out of her hair. I don't want any of that shampoo left into her hair. conditioner I can use for her Mommy, and it's because it this shampoo is just so amazing for her hair it just her hair just loves it as you know when I listen to what her hair says it just says oh yes her hair really really loves this shampoo and that is the curly cues 
coconut drench around this conditioner. Um, I paid $13.99 from my local beauty from my local beauty supply store, Mommy, and it's a 16 fluent ounce. Mommy. Yes. So I'll get close so you guys can see how that is her natural texture. And it is beautiful. Okay. So we're going to apply this in a direction set to leave it on for five minutes. And you know we're going to leave it on for 10. You know how we do. And I do not add any oils or anything to this part of her conditioner. Just because I've already oiled her hair, or well, put oil into her hair, that hopefully, um, I'm sorry, I'm just trying to get the paper off. Um, that hope that already hopefully penetrated her strands, and this conditioner is so good, you can use it literally with nothing else. Why is it being? Okay, so I'm going to leave this on for about 10 minutes. I'm not going to I'm talking here. I'm going to make sure I get her ends because it's important to make sure her ends are extremely healthy. Okay, so I'm going to leave this on for 10 minutes and we'll be right back. Okay, guys, so we're back. I'm about to rinse it out. It's been like 10 minutes. In the back right is the Family Feud. Me and my family, we watch Family Feud every day. We love Family Feud. Just drew here in the back. So I'm just going to rinse this out. Putting on cologne. Putting on cologne. Now remember guys, you want to rinse this out, not cold, go on cool air so you can make sure you um, try to keep it. Stop, mama. Start at the ends. This 
the last part and I'm not going to this is really cold water but I'm not going to put this on her scalp this is just going on directly onto her hair because I want to close her cuticle on your hand baby Stay right there, Mama. Put up close look at her texture. It is absolutely beautiful. The curls are nice and popping. She's so silly. So her hair is nice and detangled and nice and fresh and moisturized. If anything, it's really, really nicely moisturized. So her leave-ins that I'm gonna put in her hair today. Is going to be the Shea Morris's Organic Coconut and Hibiscus Curl and Style Milk. I like this. But I mix this with the Shea Morris's Organic Raw Shea Butter Restorative Candy. Mommy, how These two together. Will I? I can do it. Can I do it? Yeah. Thank you so much. With her hair, I do put the leave-in in her hair immediately while it's still really wet. Because as it's drying, I like for the leave-ins to already be on her hair. I don't know if you can see. Here's my nice. Are we waiting? Yes! Okay. Yeah. That. I'm gonna add a little bit of swag oil. Mommy. Mommy. A little bit of swag Mommy. oil, not a lot, to seal that in. Ponytails, and then later on, I'm going to. Later on, I'm going to. Um, what am I going to do? Can you look at me? I'm going to probably braid it up, right? So, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, let us know. What else, what else you want to say to them? Uh huh. So, thank you so much for watching. Um, and. Have any questions? Definitely hit me up. Let me know. And until the next video, say bye bye, Kennedy. Bye. <laughs> Till you guys later. Bye.